Welcome back to Fallout 4, ladies and gentlemen. We have today come across a location which is not on the map at all, um, but it seems to be a vault. So this is a vault. Well, there, there answer, that answers my question. Vault 81. Um, see, uh, there's a couple of sleeping places and storage and things outside um, hmm not much that actually says okay here's a vault so let's uh, go in and see what this is about vault 81 friendliest vault in all the commonwealth because here they don't shoot on sight Oh, so you know about this vault, Nick. What hey! Go ahead. What do you know about this vault? Let's hey, see. Valentine. Need something? Uh, thoughts? Your thoughts? You're one hell of a partner. That's okay. all for now. Got it. Okay, he, he, he doesn't look like in a chatting mood. Vault door controls. While in combat. I sort of say, I wasn't in combat. Hold it right there. Vault 81 security. I don't know where you got your hands on a working pit boy, but you better start talking. Oh, uh, okay. I got it in Vault 111. Vault 111? Haven't heard of that one yet. And what sort of business are you looking to take care of here in 81? I'm just a traveler. I thought I'd take a look around. Is that so? And you expect me to believe that? Oh, Overseer. Who is it, Edwards? Ma'am, some new Commonwealth traveler. Not one of our usual traders. Well, if someone wants in, they can earn it like everyone else. Let me speak to them. Sorry about that. Officer Edwards here was just doing his job. I'm sure you can understand our need for caution. For newcomers, we like to operate on exchange. You help us, we help you. Okay. But I'm a fellow vault dweller. Can't you just let me in? Excuse me, ma'am. Before you arrived, she did say she was from Vault 111, and she's in possession of a working pit boy. Is that so? Hmm. I'm going to allow it. Edwards, open the door and make the announcement. Officer Edwards and I will meet you at the entrance. Okay, that's something you haven't done before. Come on, man. Hmm. My guys have been working doubles for weeks now. They need a break. Everyone's working hard right now, Cal. You think I don't know that? Just do the best with what you can. That's all I'm asking. Goodness, Fine. I'll you, see man. what I can do. But you and I both know we can't keep going on like this. Sorry about that. As you'll soon see, we have a few maintenance projects underway. Gwen McNamara, Overseer. Welcome to Vault 81. We've never encountered a fellow vault dweller. Is this Vault 111 you mentioned still operational? Not anymore. No. Not anymore. I'm sorry to hear that. What happened there? Did something go wrong? They had us cryogenically frozen in these pods. But something malfunctioned. Oh my god. All those lives lost due to some malfunction? That's unacceptable. I suppose we've been lucky. Here, we pride ourselves on having maintained a successful vault over these past two centuries. We'd like to be completely self-sufficient, but there are certain resources we can't provide ourselves. I'm impressed you maintained a successful vault for this long. Thanks. 
I owe it to the overseers before me, but some here would disagree. A few believe opening the doors to the Commonwealth was a mistake. Interaction is a good thing. The Commonwealth is improving. So I've heard. But it's still got a long ways to go. Now, I have work to do. Ma'am, what about her, uh, friend here? I'll allow it. Security is already extra mindful as it is. If she's lived this long in the Commonwealth, I'm sure she's chosen her friends wisely. If you need anything else, I'll be in my office. Okay. I don't cool. want to hear any negative reports about you, outsider. Hmm. Hey, who are you, Neil? Okay, he doesn't want to talk. Another outsider? What they let you in for? What's with the... What's with the attitude? I don't trust outsiders. We didn't need your help before, we don't need it now. The Overseer never should have opened up the vault to your kind. I'm a fellow vault dweller. I don't care where you're from. It's not here. Yes. Okay. Um. Nico, you're like a coffee break or what's your story? Let's go have a look. Okay, that's... No signs of radiation. Impressive. If you hey, need a doctor... Ashes? Forsyth and Rachel are down in the medical center. Ashes, where they are you can going? patch you up. Ash! Okay. Damn it. Aaron's not going to like this. Hey, they got the... Oh, they got the cat. That's gonna Your be... Your Pip-Boy ever act up on you? Something's Mine's been glitchy lately. Breakfast. What's down here? Oh, security. Okay. Uh... Don't make me regret letting you in here. Okay, okay, jeez. Let's go see Stay what's out of trouble. down this way. Hmm. Hey, lady, are you really from the Commonwealth? Uh, yes, I am. Yes, I am. I knew it! Hey, I can show you around the ball if you want. Just five caps. Hmm. That's not necessary. I can find my own way around. Oh, you're no fun. <laughs> Sorry, kid. Okay, well, let's see. Uh... Must be rough living out there. Hey. Yeah? Yeah. I'm heading out. Don't wait up for me. Again? She's but looking I pretty need your bad help in here. there. Please, you haven't needed my help in years. So whatever it is, it can wait. Oh, so Aaron and I can just wait? You're gone more than you're here. Whatever happened to loving husband and father? Stop nagging at me, Alexis. I heard we had a traitor in today. Now, where did I put those screws? Hmm, okay. <laughs> Sorry, new gal. Not a lot of time to talk right now. I'll be quick. I promise. Ha! We'll see about that. What can I do you for? So there's a lot of upkeep going on right now? Hell, you could say that again. Old lady one here, she's a straight up wreck. Pretty solid for a while, easy enough to keep up with her needs, but in the last few years or so, damn, she got feisty. Been going through tools like they were going out of style, so if you got any, I'd be more than happy to take them off your hands. How much are you paying? I'd say 15 caps per tool. Overseer won't let me go higher, but I'll take as many as you can grab. Sure. You got yourself a deal. Stupendous. One less thing to bug the Overseer about. Mm. Anyway, here I am running my mouth when there's work to do. Sorry I can't talk longer, stranger. But mind the maintenance. Shouldn't get in your way, at least. Okay, cool. Uh, overseers in that direction. Well, let's go and see. The overseer. Security.
Okay, that's not... I mean, where is music playing now? Take time to look around. You'll have the full run of the place. Overseer. Have you been down to medical to see Dr. Forsyth yet? He told me he's very interested in meeting you. Okay. You don't have much to say. We can't go on there. So there's a doctor looking for us. What I wouldn't give for some real time off. And watch I'm out for the maintenance. It never ends around here. If you want a good meal, see Maria at the cafeteria. She'll hook you up. They may actually be out there. If so, it makes sense that they're keeping a low profile. It's a dangerous idea, and it's met by some very mixed reactions around the Commonwealth. Looking for a meal? See Maria. She runs the Sunshine Diner in the atrium. Mm, you whipping yeah. up a new batch of pies today? I heard Alexis promise one to Ellen, and I know how you hate to disappoint the little ones. Marcus William Somerset. Oh. You must be that new travel. Where the hell is this freaking idea? You're that Commonwealth Traveler, aren't you? Is that your Pip-Boy? It better be. Thanks, Horatio. I love it. I didn't think I'd ever make it in with the hours I've been working. Uh, but you did. And now you look completely refreshed. Just remember, a couple months and you come back and see me again. Now, off with you. Get some rest. No promises there, but I'll... Excellent. Try. So much knowledge uh, was lost I was when the bombs hit. By. Now I Good know see from experience trying to bring it back. shows no mercy when it... I guess that's a no. Don't want any trouble in 81. You must be that new traveler Gwen let in. It's always nice to see a new face around here. Nice place you have here. Why, thank you. Mark and I try to keep her tidy. The Sunshine Diner, we call her. If you need any food for the road or just feeling hungry, you let me know. Our menu isn't quite as exotic as the Commonwealth, but it'll do in a pinch. Hmm. Let's see what you got. Selection isn't what it used to be, but I still got a few good things. Okay, well, technically you actually don't have much. Okay, well, that's the diner area. Let's see, yeah, there was a doctor looking for us. There we got a barber. Yes. Um, they grow veg things Never over there. Never had an incident on my watch, and I don't want to start today. Residential. Yeah. Through, yeah. Dude, Excuse me. It's hard not to take my work home with me, but I promised Austin. Mm, okay. Uh, let's see, classroom. Classroom, let's see what's going on now. There's nobody in the classroom yet. Okay, 
Okay, uh... What is this? Somebody's house. You got guts wearing that Pip Boy in the Commonwealth. I can't believe someone hasn't tried to steal you. Careful, outsider. What did I do wrong now? Jeez. Okay, let's see what else I can find around here. Nice Pip Boy. If it ever starts acting up on you, see Alexis. She'll fix it right up. Okay. Yeah. Is this radio playing? Who's this? Kate. Hey. Oh, you're that new traveler. You must have had so many adventures out in the Commonwealth. Every waking moment is an adventure out there. Oh my. I knew it. My kids would love to hear some of them. Would you be willing to talk to my class? I can do that. I'd be glad to talk to them. Marvelous. Stop by whenever class is in session. I'll just stop what I'm doing and turn the class over to you. Okay. So. Jeez. Hello, Katie. This will be a rare treat for the kids. Okay, now where is this? Doctor that we were supposed to huh? find. This place is confusing. Clinic, here we go. There must be a doctor here. Welcome, welcome. Hey, Doc. I hope I'm not being presumptuous, but I'd like to ask you a favor. Would you mind donating some medical samples? Even just the blood sample. Um okay. Sure. You can have some blood. Excellent. Just have a seat, and I'll draw some blood. Where exactly am I sitting? Probably over here, sir. Sit there. This will only take a sec. That's a big ass needle. There. Hardly hurt a bit, eh? Thank you. This will be a great help. Now, I need to get these prepared immediately. Okay. You're that wanderer from the Commonwealth. I'm Rachel. Hmm. I assist Dr. Forsyth with his medical duties. Are you sick or injured? Um, no. I need some supplies, Doctor. Great. Let's take a look. Okay, well, you actually don't have much. You don't have much. Okay, well, there's nothing going on here. I see a lot of folks at their worst in my line of work. It's hard to not let it get to you sometimes. Nothing happening in there. Okay, well now we've been everywhere. Uh, where's the classroom again? The Commonwealth sounds so exciting and dangerous. Okay, now that's a residential area. Uh, where was that classroom? Was it on this side? Seeds. You can get lost in this seeds. place. Um, I'll be damned if that whole duct isn't gonna need replacing. Looking for a meal? See Maria. She runs the Sunshine Diner in the atrium. Yeah, definitely not looking for that. I'm trying to figure out where this music is coming from. The work never ends in Vault 81. Watch out for the maintenance. It never ends around here. What can I get? Where is the... You should stop by the lab in the morning and take a look at the new crops. This is confusing. 
Are any of these kids in school? What's okay, um... There was a training thing here somewhere. If you want a new look, stop by my salon sometime. Careful, outsider. Lady chill. Okay, I don't know where everybody is. Maybe we just wait a while. Let's sit. Okay, wait, let's see, it's PM. Okay, well, there's no wonder. Uh, six, seven, uh, eight hours. Long time. Everybody now at work or watch yourself. Ah, <sighs> what I wouldn't give for some real time off. Nope. Come on, why are we taking so long to get here? Now, where did I put those screws? Okay, well. Hi, Our lady. Commonwealth guest, welcome to the depot. And pardon the clutter, I don't get much time to tidy up these days. Hmm. Why not? No time? Why not? Ugh, where to begin? When you're dealing with items that are all over 200 years old, work just accumulates like crazy. Some days it's all I can do to keep my head above water. But you probably don't want to hear about all that. Let me know if you want to take a look. Do you run this place by yourself? Well, there's my husband, Halt, but once you need him, he's nowhere to be found. I swear the cat is more help than he is. He sounds pretty unreliable to me. You don't even mm. know. So, you have anything you don't need anymore, or are you just here to gossip? Okay, I, I might be interested in buying or selling. Great, I have all sorts of odds and ends. Let's see, what do you got? Weapons. Overseer's Guardian. What's this? Sniper rifle. Shoots additional projectile. Okay. Um, what is this damage on this thing? 101. Um, where is my... 132. Okay. Ugh, oh, let's take it anyway. Uh, oh, okay. Overseer is the right thing. Pretty pricey, but I got the caps for it. Uh, destroy right leg. I've got one of those. Added to collection. Overseer's left arm guard. Okay, vault. Jumpsuit. Uh, aid. Miscellaneous. Junk. You got all of these. What shipments? Do you have any shipments? Ceramic. Concrete, copper, fiber, optics. Okay, that's kind of cool. Um, let's see, how's my ammo looking like? Uh, no, I've got pretty much enough ammo. Uh, ammo fusion, cores. Okay, I think I've spent... Uh, Enough money by you, all seventeen grain. Need to check the water pumps again. The water seems <coughs> funny. Anything I can get you today? Let's see. Do you run this place by yourself? Well, there's my husband Halt, but once you need him, he's nowhere to be found. I swear the cat is more help than he is. Why do you say that? I really shouldn't get into it. No, you can. It's all right. You can tell me. Halt's just changed. He's never around, always claiming he has some errands to run. Back when we first met, he seemed devoted till the end. 
He actually taught me everything I know when it comes to fixing things. He'd spend every minute he could with me, and of course Aaron after we had her. Now it's like we don't exist, and every conversation we have is a fight. Have you talked to him about it? I've tried, but he won't listen to me. He's always saying he doesn't have time. Hmm. If he's treating you like this, maybe you should leave him. It's not that easy. At least not in the vault. Plus there's Aaron to think about. And that stupid part of me that still loves him. Anyway, I should get back to work, but thanks for the chat. It's good to get things off my chest. Let me know if there's anything you're interested in. Hmm. What do you sell? Odds and ends. A bit of everything, I suppose. But no weapons. Only security guards carry weapons around here. Not today. I'm here if you do. Okay, well, let's head to that classroom. Uh, now I've got to try and remember to find it. But I wouldn't from. give for some brand spanking new genuine Vault Tech parts right now. Uh, it's this way. Careful, outsider. I must say, this vault is very quiet. Hey, there's some kids in the class. Would you like to tell the students one of your stories now? I'd be glad to. Wonderful. The kids are so excited. Children! Children, listen up. We have a guest today who is going to tell us stories about the Commonwealth. Did you ever fight a Death Claw? Death Claws are very dangerous. Huh. It was a tough fight. How did you beat it? I was shot up pretty bad by the raiders that had my friend Preston trapped. But you were still able to rescue him, right? Preston showed me where to find some power armor I could fix. Power armor! Wow. <laughs> I wasn't ready when the Death Claw crawled out. Good thing I had that power armor. That sounds scary. I was hurt pretty badly, but Preston and I finally killed it. Wow. Thank you so much for that story. Children, say thank you. Thank, thank you. you. And we have a thank you gift for you. Here. Hey, I get up another mag. Cool. Whoa! A mm. real live Commonwealth person. You dress funny. Well, hello. Excuse me, ma'am. Have you seen my cat? Ash is gone? Oh, no. I think he's left the vault. I saw him run by me when I got here. Left the vault? Oh, please bring him back. Please. No one else would set foot outside for him. Hey, I'll find him for you. Thank you. His name is Ashes. He's the sweetest little gray cat. I just want him to come home. Okay, well, Bet that's... Bet you wish you took the tour now. <laughs> this kid and his tours. Um, okay, which way is the... The exit? No, not this way. We need to go and find a cat. Well, that cat that we saw when we it's got came into the vault. The hybridization. So yep, let's... good old lady one. She's going to hell in a handbasket. Let's quickly talk to this lady. Ah, you'll do perfectly. I'm in need of a willing test subject to try this new strain of fruit I've created. Okay. Sure. I like fruit. Excellent. Just tell me how it tastes and how it makes you feel. Hmm. Now, where did I put that Geiger counter? Okay, so I suppose I've got to eat this fruit. Uh, aid. P 
Pardon me, Dr. Pensky. Did you try the fruit? Tell me, how was it? Uh, good. It was good. No adverse effects. I knew it. This is good progress. I'll have to start a new batch right away. Since you've been so helpful, maybe you can help out in another capacity. You see, I need these plants to conduct my studies, and they take some special nourishment, especially the carrots. If you could keep an eye out for fertilizer while you're out in the Commonwealth, I'll be more than happy to compensate you for your efforts. Okay. Sure. I can do that. Really? Great. I was dreading having to put in another request to the Overseer. Just bring by whatever you can find whenever you have the time. Damn it. I was just holding that wrench. Okay, we better go get the cat. But, doesn't this lady sell fertilizer here? Yeah? Is that your pit boy? It better be. I swear, it's something new every day. Let's check if she's got fertilizer. Hey, looking for something? I have more stuff than I know what to do with. Let's see what you got. Great. I have all sorts of odds and ends. Um. Uh. No. Okay, she doesn't have fertilizer. Now let's Nothing go and find. You may be able to lend a hand. Talk to Calvin. You may find have a job for you. That poor cat. Okay. Well, at least it's daylight outside. Um. Now, where is this cat? Okay, hold on a sec. Uh, kitty, kitty, kitty. That. There you are. What is going on? Why am I getting leg spikes? For someone to be. Hey, you. Go home. Ashes, go home. Aaron misses you. Come on. Move. Yes, go. There are things here, but it will eat you for a snack. Okay. At least that little girl's gonna be happy that cat is back. <sighs> well, ah, I wouldn't give we go. some real time off. Austin got himself bit by a mole rat, so now they got us cooped up in here to watch Aaron. It's ridiculous. Yeah, uh, um. Ashes! You found him! Yes. Thanks, ma'am. I was so worried about him. You're welcome. I'm so glad he's safe. Ashes! Bad kitty. I was so worried about you. I hope you don't have and anything that needs fixing. I really don't feel like working. Hello, Holt. Keep walking, outsider. I know. Just because I don't you like wear a vault suit doesn't mean you're one of us. But I'm just happy you're back. You're still here. You're a pain in the butt. Probably gonna need some sort of sealant. Overseer will be happy about that. Hmm. Okay. Well, I think we need to go to the doctor. We heard something about someone being bit by something. Remember, no huh? funny business. Um. Is it this way? Calvin's always looking for tools. I heard he'll pick caps if you got them. Potential. That's the classroom. The doctor was somewhere. There we go. You have to do something, Jacob. I'm running the test as fast as I can, Priscilla. 
I can't treat Austin until I know what he's infected with. Dr. Forsythe. Not now, Bobby. And you, stranger, will have to wait your turn. We have an emergency here. Austin got bitten by a mole rat. Isn't that enough, Jacob? There can't be that many mole rat diseases or toxins. Rachel is examining the mole rat. Hopefully she'll find something. But these aren't ordinary mole rats. Who knows what kind of diseases they are carrying. Because he's just a child, it's affecting him more severely. Dr. Forsyth, please. I think I found something that might help Austin. Bobby! Hold on, Priscilla. What is it, Bobby? Well, you know that door Austin found? He found it because of me. I keep my private things in there. He saw me get them. You mean your chems? Get to the point, Bobby. What did you find in that place? It's like a whole extra vault in there, but half ruined and caved in. There was this terminal there, so I started poking around in it. There were some notes and stuff about using mole rats to grow viruses. But they also said that they used them to make vaccines and treatments. A secret vault. Good lord, I've never heard of such a thing. Bobby, you're a genius. A junkie genius. There might be a cure for whatever Austin got from that mole rat somewhere in that place. You there. How would you like to do Vault 81 a favor and possibly save my boy's life? Okay. I would be glad to help. I was hoping I could count on you. Bobby here will show you where he keeps his secret stash. There is a chance that somewhere in there is a cure for Austin. If you find it, bring it to Dr. Forsyth. And for Austin's sake, please hurry. Follow me. Hole in the wall. Find the cure. Careful of the mole rats down there. If they infected Austin, they could infect you as well. Dr. Forsyth has okay. been very honest about Austin's prognosis. I'm so scared I'll lose him. Let's see, hole in the wall. Okay, well that's the next thing we're going to have to do. But I think we're going to leave that first year for a part two. Okay, well it's guys. It's frustrating that all our medical knowledge uh, hasn't been enough to help Austin. Lady, I'm kind of in the middle of something here. Yeah. Okay, well there we go. Okay, this is going to be the first part. We'll do a second part about finding the cure and exploring the rest of the vault. So we've met quite a few people and everything. So till the next one, I'll see you guys again. Cheers.